Greetings everybody from Atlanta, Georgia, where Monday three SEC coaches kicked off media days for the year 2022. LSU head coach Brian Kelly, Ole Miss head coach Lane Kiffin, and Missouri head man Eli Drinkwitz kicked off the fun on Monday, and they all three were asked about the same man, Alabama head coach Nick Saban. Well, like Kirby Smart used to say, sometimes you come up here and just end up talking about Alabama. So our first question somehow is about Nick Saban. So that's pretty usual. Alabama isn't even scheduled to speak at SEC Media Days until Tuesday morning, but that didn't stop Nick Saban and the Crimson Tide from being one of the main topics of discussion from day one in Atlanta. Because when you win that much, have that level of experience, your peers certainly take notice. Coach Saban has had the ability to be a head coach at a lot of different places within a lot of different frameworks, and he's figured out what makes him and his program successful. Brian Kelly faced off twice against Saban when he was at Notre Dame. And Monday, Kelly was asked if some of those lopsided defeats at the hands of the Crimson Tide were a factor why he took his new job at LSU. I thought we played Alabama better than anybody in, in that last playoff. Um, their, their talent, you know, was unbelievable on the offensive side of the ball that year. Um, so that wasn't like, well, I'm taking the LSU job. Alabama was so much better than us. That was not part of the process. Ole Miss head coach Lane Kiffin took the podium Monday as just one of many former Saban disciples. And for Kiffin, it's not just the fact that there's so many branches hanging off that Saban coaching tree, but just the quality of jobs they've landed after working in Tuscaloosa. I would doubt that there's ever been a coach in any sport, college or professional, that has so many people under him that are at major jobs. I mean, you're talking about top 25 jobs. And all this Saban talk is a good lead in for the man who will arrive Tuesday morning along with reigning Heisman Trophy winning quarterback Bryce Young, safety Jordan Battle, and elite edge rusher Will Anderson Jr. And we're going to be here all week bringing you the sights and sounds from SEC Media Days 2022. From the College Football Hall of Fame here in Atlanta, Georgia, I'm Johnny Condon, ABC 3340 Sports.